Hello, internet friends. A new world boss is up. The Nether Disruptor has reappeared, and it seems that each buff the Nether Disruptor has is tied to a specific world boss. We are here on the coast. We have Savash. Now, Savash is the big old crazy ugly. I mean, unless you're into that kind of thing. Naga Lady. Savash commands the Fury of the Sea, bringing its power to bear on those too close to shore. Her fierce Savashi honor guard travel with her across Azeroth's oceans, eager for vulnerable harbors to destroy. So she casts tidal waves, a slow moving but massive. It cannot be avoided by moving at the last minute. So dodge tidal wave by watching the seas. Avoid submerged stuns. Healers dodge tidal waves. Tanks dodge tidal waves. And gather the Savashi honor guard before they harm your allies. All world bosses, of course, drop. It says 900 loot now, thankfully. It's supposed to, it would say like 890 in the previous video. But let's, uh, let's go find a group and go see these massive tidal waves that Savash has in store for us. All right. And as per usual, right when you find a group, here she is. And where are these? Oh. All right. Those are, those are rather large waves. Can we just tank this wave in meta form and be okay? Oh gosh, we're gonna find out. Oh, that's it. Oh, okay. Got some honor guard back here. Get some some AOE damage on him, I guess. All world bosses, because the command center is up at the same time. You get the Kirin Tor bubbles, but you do double damage when you're in them. So world bosses sort of melt right now. But those, oh gosh, those are the submerges. Oh, it puts you in a bubble. Oh, it stun you and they start drowning? What's happening to these people? They're stunned, they take frost damage. Okay. Oh, there's a wave coming. The waves are uh, impressive looking actually, but they don't do any damage. Watch, here again, whee! Little splish splash, but nothing too difficult, huh? That's that. I got a 905 ring. You know what? I have rerolls waiting for my demon hunter. Let's roll again. Artifact power. Perfect. A 905 ring. Yeah, it's crit mastery. Hmm. Could be pretty good. Well, that was Savash and her massive tidal waves. Hopefully, you all get some good loot. Ari did her on my Enhancement Shaman. She drops a really good Storm Relic that is Wind Strikes, my best trait. And, of course, I got nothing and Artifact Power, as per usual. But thank you all so much for watching. Go get your fat loots for your ults. Have fun on the Broken Shore. Thank you all again for your support on the channel. I'll see you all in the next Legion video.